you know, sticking on therapy, are you one of the individuals that believe that everyone needs therapy? Or do you believe therapy should kind of be viewed as like similar to like the doctor, right? Like you're supposed to go to the doctor like once a year for like a checkup or is it twice a year, whatever it is. But other than that, you know, you kind of go when you need to go. So, you know, how, how do you view the role therapy should play in, in the lives of people? Um, I do think a great deal of people can, can benefit from therapy. Um, does everyone need to? Maybe not. But what I do know that is even if you're not having significant mental or emotional distress, you can still go to therapy to work out some stuff. And so it depends on what the needs of the, the person, like some people say, you know, you know, they had a bad breakup for whatever reason at this point in their life, a bad breakup is, is causing them issues. Sometimes they, they're, hey, they need to process some trauma. Other times they're just feeling lost in life and they need to talk some things through. And so therapy doesn't have to be this severe event that leads to therapy. Um, but again, there's something, again, where I talked about us being the social animal, we're social animals. There's something about talking it through with another person. When you go talk to a professional versus getting talking to a friend, wow, that's crazy. I hope I hope everything works out, bro. Like, man, you're gonna get our, our man up and that's chase the bag, chase the bag, bro. Like all those things that they don't know how to do. And, and that kind of goes back to being authentic and genuine and vulnerable, where people don't know how to say, hey, bro, like listen, I need to talk to you about something. I don't need your advice or I do need your advice. I just need you to listen. I don't need you to say anything. Um, you know, I just need somebody to talk to. People don't know how to create that support system. And it's very awkward for us as regular humans who are not trained in psychology and therapy. We're like, damn, like this man and this woman just support her. Cause oh, I don't know what the hell to say to them. Like, I, I, I'm here for you. What does that mean? Right? Like, and so, and on the other end of that, people don't know how to say, hey, you, you just said a lot. What, what do you need from me right now? Instead of trying to figure out, uh, well, well, this is what you should do, bro. Like, if that was me, I would have did. Maybe they don't want to hear that. Or maybe they do. But what I do in these situations, I'm like, when, I, when my friends hit me up, like, I'm like, man, that's a lot. What do you need from me right now? You need some advice? You, you need me to, you know, to sit here with you? What do you need? Because I don't, I don't want to be figuring it out because I don't, I don't know what you want. And so I, I coach and train my friends to tell me exactly what it is that they're needing from me in this moment. It's so crazy that we say, wow, I mean, that's crazy, right? Because I do that too. And I realize I do it because I don't, <laughs> don't know what to say. <laughs> like people, and look, here's the thing. Friends don't know sometimes that when they come to you with stuff, um, dude, listening is draining too. Like depending on what, what, like what is being discussed, you feel yourself getting like, yo, this is like, this is a lot. Like, you know, and I can't do nothing for you really. <laughs> you know? I'm a trained professional, and when my friends come, and I'm like, I've trained them to the point like you got 30 minutes. You got 30 <laughs> minutes. Let me know. Like, I'm not much of a small talk person. Like, I like to get to the point. You can literally hit me up and just say, Hey, you know, um, call me. Like, one, I don't need your good morning. Like, hey, you know, figure out if I'm free and get to the point. <laughs> I, I I I'm like that, and people think like it's kind of rude, but like, no, like. Even when I'm not doing something, I'm doing something. Like mentally up here, I'm always doing something. So you're going to interrupt, which is cool. So you're needing me in this moment. I'm your friend. We've established that kind of relationship. Let's talk about it. Let's get to the root of the issue. 